NSFW, what's the worst thing you done as a horny teen? Used plastic wrap as a condom. You. You're the one my mother warned me about, never trust a man, Tilly. They'll tell you plastic wrap works as a condom and I promise you it doesn't. I'd use for mummifications so it works like that. Masturbated using shampoo, thought, would feel nice. It did, only till I needed to pee afterwards. Drenched the living soul out of me. We've all been down that road. And I thought I just ruined my pee pee for the rest of my life. Literally climbed a mountain so I could jack off in peace away from my family. Did it twice on the same vacation. This man is dedicated. Stick the beep in vacuum cleaner to get sucked off. I said don't disturb me when I'm cleaning my room. Not sure how many people caught that in scary movie Tears of Joy. Masturbated staring at a glass of water because I saw on TV that 15 year olds can jerk off looking at anything. I do therapy now. Lol that's a vibe. Got off to a private lap dance in GTA 5. I judged someone if they said they hadn't. I never played GTA 5. Got into a serious relationship that lasted 14 years. Worst idea ever. I felt bad about 4 years gone along with a lot of confidence, I get this one. Great grandmother owned a sewing shop back in the day, a place you could buy various sewing supplies. The shop was mostly frequented by women, and it turned out that my great grandmother would also secretly sell wax beef asterisk. Very realistic ones. One day I found a box of stock from that shop in the attic. Imagine my surprise when I found like five or six wax penises in there. Thought it was amusing and didn't think much of it. Until a couple months later. Horny, home alone and desperate, I recalled the discovery I had made months earlier. I went into the attic, grabbed the wax figure that appealed to me most, washed it and had my fun with it. As it turns out, when wax is in a warm environment, it begins to lose its shape. A discovery I made once I removed the wax beep from my, um, self. After prolonged exposure to a 38. 5C environment, the wax figure had lost its shape and no longer resembled a beep. It was basically just a wax stick. I tried to give it back its previous shape but I'm no sculptor. I put it in the bin, hidden sort of in the middle of the bin so it wouldn't be visible to anyone opening the bin but also not visible through the bag once it was emptied. And that was that. It did the job, which is pretty cool for a 100-year-old wax beat, but its supply was limited and since wax wasn't the best medium to use for internal pleasure, I decided to buy myself proper beep toys shortly after. Made my own flashlight and even the beep doll. Masturbated to my own, created characters and erotic beep asterisk. Hey, at least you were being creative. I used a knife to open a hole on my giant teddy bear thinking I could have beep with him. Spoiler, I couldn't. Ruined the bear. Brother. You and I share minds. That makes three of us boys. Actually, four, as long as a giant stuffed Bugs Bunny doll counts. Put my beep in a hose. Got hard. Turned the water on. Tore the inner skin. Painful AF. Now I can pull the beep skin down an extra inch. Thinks my beep hurts now. Masturbated with the handle of a hairbrush using hair gel and nail polish as lube. Oh god. Take my upvote. Take my hairbrush. Take my hair gel and nail polish. Take my polish remover. My first fap was to a girl on a coloring pencil case edit. Grammar asterisk 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 asterisk. Oh also accidentally going too far with a makeshift asterisk 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 asterisk. Pause. I fucked my teddy bear. I'm sorry man. Same. Pick the girlfriend who is hot rather than the girlfriend who is nice. Look at MR fancy pants here with options. I laughed my beep of reading this. Take my up vote. Fucked the crevasse between the couch cushions. If you did this to Alyssa Milano in the 80s, you are my husband. Lady, if you ask every man that has fucked the crevasse between the couch cushions if he is your husband, then we are going to be here a long time. Humped a pile of mud. Mother Nature's is the ultimate milk. I have to ask if anybody wondered about your muddy crotch. I explore woods naked and find a place to take care of matters at hand. Some older guy told me and my friends that girls subconsciously crave the smell of semen in your underpants. This one kid fell for it? To be honest, the rest of us were disgusted by him trying it out for the next few days, but we were curious to see if it worked. Worked. It didn't. 
so he just nuttered into his underwear and walked around in his own goop. Well that's enough Reddit for me. There have been nutter story on this sub trust me. Masturbated with cucumber with a condom that my father hid in the closet. I'm sorry, did you just say that you masturbated with your father's used condom on his cucumber that he had, hidden in the closet? As in, it was up his asterisk asterisk asterisk. That's one way to read a sentence. Judging from how too many of these answers are, I apparently was one weird child. When I was in middle school age, I for some reason decided that just using my hands to beep was not good enough. So I attempted several times to make homemade beep toys I could beep asterisk. I recall making one out of a paper towel tube, and destroyed a stuffed animal trying to make another. Also, we didn't have cable TV, and high-speed internet was not a thing yet, so I used to draw my own pornographic cartoons and pictures to Beepa. I also on multiple occasions stuck my beef asterisk between the cushions on the couch. One time I used the hose from the vacuum cleaner to see how it would feel. The one thing I did that nobody has mentioned here was use a PlayStation controller as a sort of vibrator on my beef asterisk. IIRC, there was an NHL hockey game where if you press the right button during a menu screen, it would make a buzzer sound, which would cause the controllers to vibrate. I held down the button on one controller with one hand for like 10 straight minutes while pressing the other controller on my beef asterisk with the other hand. I like to think of myself as the MacGyver of masturbation. As handheld back massagers, I used to press them against my beep until I started coming spasmatically in every direction. 13. Jack to mid-90s Hillary Clinton. Not teen me but at 12 it was to Ricky Lake. Ricky Lake was a bombshell at the time. I used two Mr. Clean Magic erasers and one latex glove to make a homemade beep toy. I used shampoo as lube. It's not the worst but the worst feeling one. In dad's room. He was sleeping. Only TV in the house. 14 years old. Masturbated to late night call girls on TV on mute. I was super horny one afternoon. Since I was home alone, I was excited to find something adventurous for me to beep with. My closet door had a hole in it where a doorknob was supposed to be installed. I padded this hole with lens cloths that I had for my glasses, since it was the softest fabric I had. After shaping the hole to the size of my beep, I got a step stool so that the hole was at the appropriate height. The inside of the closet actually had more headroom than the outside, so I brought my stool inside the closet, closed the door, and began beep the doorknob hole. It felt alright, but still had a bit more friction than what was ideal. As I went, I noticed my beep becoming more lubricated which made the experience more enjoyable. I assumed it was pre-cum so I kept going. Once I got close, I stopped to take a break and felt something strange. My beep was pretty sore and numb from the friction, but it felt as though something was touching the end of my beep. I slowly opened the closet door and saw my dog sitting there, panting happily with drool dripping from his chop, his chops. Well, that's enough Reddit for me today. See y'all tomorrow. LMFAO. At 16 I had beep in the same room as another couple having beep rooms were limited at that party. It reeked of cigarettes. When I came home at 3 a.m., my mother was still up and livid. It was pitch dark in the hallway and just remember her yelling, is that a hickey? I went to bed and I heard her scolding my dad for not being more upset and then she went to sleep on the couch. That's the only time in my life I've ever hear my parents kind of fight. The next day I saw how bad it was and asked her to help me cover it with makeup and seal it with hairspray before my basketball game. Throw away account because I am ashamed. Used my mom's asterisk 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 asterisk. That's not even that bad. I'm a guy and used my sister's before to beat my asterisk asterisk asterisk. Around three or four years ago, my brother went to his friend's house just to play games. And me, I locked the front door, then I went to my room closed the window blinds and locked my room, I stripped naked, go on Pornhub so to get rid of my horniness. Then 8 minutes later, I got spooked by the door bell rang 6 times. I hurried to put my clothes on and open the door. It was my idiot bro, he forgot his wallet and he asked me, why you're so sweaty. Tell him you were watching cops. I shoved my electric toothbrush up my beep for the first go at anal. Was cleaning it off because beep asterisk was stuck in the cracks, accidentally flooded the thing with water and it wouldn't for the love of god turn off. 
So alas, there I was, 1am in the dark depths of my bathroom, desperately holding this stupid toothbrush so it would stop vibrating, my fingers going numb. Realized I had to throw it out and my mom still hasn't noticed its disappearance. This was two days ago. I wish you the best in your dental hygiene and anal pleasure endeavor ours. Drove 12 hours, going so fast I shaved an hour and a half of my previous drive time, to surprise a girl I had been having phone beep with. Only got a beep beep asterisk. But I did get that. Then I found out she not only had a boyfriend but she was also cheating on him with another guy who, showed up. I left town immediately, somewhat satisfied but also physically safe. Still amazes me to this day that a guy who is the other guy would get so mad at his not girlfriend is cheating on him. I don't know if that technically qualified as cheating on him. Her actual boyfriend yes but the side piece. Crazy. Nearly paid for the only fans of a girl I know. I can see myself doing this simply out of curiosity. Humped my bed so hard till climax. Got head from my wife at our church camp back in high school. We couldn't keep our hands off each other the whole weekend and I feel terrible but it was some good, dome. I don't think I've heard it referred to as dome since 2003 haha. My girlfriend and I are laying on the couch together. My mom is asleep in a chair two feet away. We fucked like animals right next to her making no effort to be quiet. Mom didn't wake up because she was out after her 13th can of Milwaukee's best ice. I was